and maybe suit his eye. Henry tied to 13th at Quill Hollow last week. And when he's on the top of his game, you would expect this to be easily within 10 feet. In just for position, driving iron off the tee for Henrik. Well, that bounces nicely down into that left half of the fairway. Which will tend to promote a little right to left movement. <laughs> That's played beautifully. Thank you. Well, you can give him that. Can be very mentally draining, and which ultimately is physically draining. See, I told you, yeah, Mike. That, you you, you got you to you you complete the task. <laughs> you can't just yeah. give it to him. 166. Just coming off the birdie back at the second. Yeah, down the tube as well, wasn't it? Yeah, this is about a cup out on the left. Bring to the right. That was not quite high enough to begin with. And he's blocked this into the right rough. Yeah, I don't understand this play at all. Yeah, that's the risk with that. Being in the rough, but it's uh, no threat of a jumper. So, not a good iron off the tee. Probably no more than a seven iron. Uh, this so guy is too far to I'm, I'm, to I'm absolutely, to die through I'm it. absolutely justifying. But look. Look where he is. Well, He'd have a wedge in his hand. Eight. He could be throwing a dart if he hit a three wood, which is his absolute strength. He's going to move a lot more to the right early, and then crest that hill and now go back to the left. You know what's oh, going to go away. You know go away. Oh, Apparently, Cody, he played the hole exactly the way you're supposed to. Nice. Nice. And that's beautiful up the right hand side. Yep. Ideal. What a big drive with that three wood to get it down here inside 200 yards. This is left of the hole, though. Could he get the right bounce? Ooh, that's right on. Oh. Now that was never really high enough. Yeah. Just moving a little right. Quickly to three under. He got a lot of club on that. And this was going to try to catch that hump, but he didn't get up on it. Has the speed, has the speed. Pretty good. On the tee, Henrik Stenson. Well, a heavy thud there. This one just a little right of the flag, middle of the green. Okay, good shot. Thanks. Whoa. Well, and that's exactly what he did, Johnny, but uh, still a good putt. So we go to eight and Matt. And Henrik Stenson, again, just trying to put it in position. There's a creek down the left. You don't want to be in the rough. Fairway bunker down the right hand side. Most players lay up to that bunker. Dog legs around that bunker back uphill to the green. Sound is solid in the sweet and solid. Thank you. Yeah, it's perfectly positioned. He sure is. He adds a little bit of extra spin. Gives a good crunch, doesn't he? Okay, I don't need the hole. Get the hole. Get the hole. Oh, you're kidding. That goes right. 
you really need to get the ball in the fairway. You can control your approach into this into the screen that plays uphill. Got one fairway bunker in the distance, 293 yards past that. He's left himself 170 yards coming up the hill here. Plays eight or nine yards uphill. Yes, nice leave there below the hole. There you go, out to 31, which is four under, and quickly to five under. So we go to 11. All right, Stinson again with that power three, what it looks like there, Phil. He's been wearing that in the iron out off the off the tee all day. I don't believe he's hit a driver yet. He hits that out there around 290. Yeah, that bankman's about seven feet below the the level of the green down left. So players are doing that a lot. 30 feet right of the hole, smart shot. Perhaps starting to gain some momentum. That was a good effort coming down that ridge. It's an easier route for Henrik to go super high. Uh, a little late, wasn't it? Yeah, he took it way up in the air. Yeah, my miss hit it a touch. Now yeah, there's that ridge, just sticks into the ridge. He just missed it. The same kind of look up. Got to hook a touch. It's going to get it there. Mm -hmm. Oh, there we go. Henrik. Should be all right where the flag is today. Phil, I think he likes it as well. Slightly. Seven under. That's the best in the afternoon so far. You're right, it really goes. All that that is not where you want to miss it. That's a steep bunker and the green runs away from you. Very next day he's playing on his own. And he had one of those brittle old three woods and he drops it, you know, by accident. And the shaft snaps. Oh, he set himself and kind of threw, threw himself out of balance on that one. Wow. He got very fortunate to yeah. caught a good lie and took pretty good advantage there. He got a chance for birdie now. Yeah, a good lie, little uphill. No, no. And second shot on the way. That was from 157 yards. And well done. He'd missed a couple shots to the right recently. Yeah, that's again hole high. Not even close. He's not alone, Phil. On her shoulder, lucky came off the tree. 
was certainly dusty. Pick it up. If it's dry, you see that it didn't get any real crush on the ball. So that's it. So we've now got to guess where we chips it in. <laughs> 